Hey guys, Sean Johnson here with SeanJohnsonInc.com and today I'm going to talk about habit number 9 of the top 10 habits of millionaires. Now, habit number 9 says millionaires talk about ideas. I'm going to repeat that. Millionaires talk about ideas. They don't talk about what was on uh, the new reality show. They don't talk about, you know, who won the football game last night. Well, then again, they may, but I guess it's a point in time for that. But mostly, you know, millionaires talk about ideas. So what I want to read is a little excerpt that I thought was real profound, real key, and something to really, really think about. It goes, big people talk about ideas. Average people talk about things, and small people talk about other people. I'm going to repeat that. Big people talk about ideas. Average people talk about things. And small people talk about other people. See, that that's definitely was worth repeating. Because if, if you really think about that, you know, think about what you talk about. Yeah, let me ask you that question. What do you talk about? What do you spend your time talking about? Ideas, things, or people? Just, just marinate on that and kind of dissect that and figure it out in, in your own way. So, as I continue, I'm going to read a little bit more. And talking about things, I, I read this excerpt here. Middle class people talk about things that that came from a millionaire's idea. Think about that. Middle class people talk about things that came from a millionaire's idea. I'm going to read on. They talk about things like cars, sports, entertainment, music, and vacations. Millionaires own the car companies. Millionaires own the sports teams. Millionaire produced the movies and the television shows. And that's what, you know, the, the middle class people talk about. Now, as I go on, millionaires on the vacation spots and the middle class spent his money on the things that are created by millionaires. You know, it almost wanted to make me laugh, but I mean, because it's so true if you really think about what I just read. The middle class spent his money on the things that were created by millionaires ideas see millionaires sit around and think about ideas think about things to create because then the middle class or if you want to say the low class or however you want to you know however you want to uh, pronounce or you know distribute the the classes that's what millionaires are doing they're sitting around and they're thinking ideas on how they can get you to spend money with them so it goes back to what I just said. The middle class spend his money on the things that are created by millionaires' ideas. So as I turn the page, I'm going to read a little bit more, and I'm going to wrap this up. But I, I really, really uh, suggest you get this book. Let's look at ideas. Let's just talk a little bit about what millionaires think about their ideas. Why do millionaires spend their time talking about ideas? The answer is because they understand that it takes ideas to make money. The middle class think that you must have money to make money. Now, think about your business. People always say it takes money to make money. It takes money to make money. If you, how, how, how rich would you be if you, you kept a quarter every time you heard that? You, you probably won't even be listening to this, um, this audio clip I'm doing. But millionaires know better. They understand that the right idea would attract the money they need. How profound is that? Just, just think about that. They understand that the right idea will attract the money they need. It's, it's so many times I heard a person say that they're very interested in what you got going on, but they just don't have the money. They never think, how can they get the money? What can they do to generate the money to pursue their dream? You know, they never think that. But if I read this again, millionaires understand that the right idea will attract money that they need. See, I'm going to read on because I'm getting excited. Ideas are the most important asset in the world. Ideas are the most important asset in the world. People who come up with great ideas end up with great wealth. Look at uh, Let's look at Bill Gates. What did Bill Gates come up with? What are you looking at now? Great idea, right? You, you're looking at it right now. You listen to my audio. Bill Gates, need I say more? Everything you see first started as an idea in someone's mind. So you look at the internet, you look at uh, my mentor Joe Schroeder who came up with the funded proposal. Mike Dillard just took it to another level and brought it on the internet and called it Magnetic Sponsor. Think about that. You know, ideas are, are, are awesome and, and that's what our, our nation was founded on, our idea. So in closing, 
you know, just think about what you're thinking, not what you're thinking throughout the day. You know, just just kind of think about that. I mean, you know, you know, I always say what you think about come about. You know, what you think about come about. So hey guys, that's it for me. This is our habit number nine from you know the top ten habits of millionaires. If you want to get this book, which is a great read, look at the link below. Click on that link, it'll take you right to it where you can purchase the book. Um, hey, I'll see you on the next audio clip. I'm going to be discussing habit number eight. Take care, Sean Johnson, Inc. Have a great day.